The Sullivan murder case investigates. Now were private detectives who received a phone call in the middle of the night about the Sullivan murder case. The victim had gone missing, and the police were at a loss for clues. As they began their investigation, they discovered that there was a mystery book that was connected to the case. The book was said to be cursed, and those who read it were said to suffer terrible consequences. Paul and Pete knew that they had to find the book if they were going to solve the case. They discovered that the book was divided into three parts, and each part held a clue to the whereabouts of the missing victim. As they searched for the three parts of the book, they encountered all sorts of obstacles and challenges. They faced danger at every turn, as they got closer and closer to the truth. But as they pieced together the clues from each part of the book, they finally uncovered the truth about the Sullivan murder. They discovered that the victim had been killed by someone close to them, someone who had been driven to madness by the curse of the book. With their investigation complete, Paul and Pete were able to bring the killer to justice, and the missing victim's family finally found closure. The mystery book was destroyed, and its curse was lifted forever. Paul and Pete continued to work together as private detectives, solving cases and bringing justice to those who had been wronged. They knew that their work was never done, but they were determined to make a difference in the world, one case at a time. They gathered the evidence they needed to solve the Sullivan murder case, they knew that they would have to present their findings in court. They worked tirelessly to build a strong case against the killer, and they were confident that justice would be served. Finally, the day of the trial arrived, and Paul and Pete took their place in the courtroom. They presented their evidence, including the three parts of the mystery book, and the killer was brought to justice. The victim's family finally found closure, and the people of the town breathed a sigh of relief knowing that a dangerous killer was off the streets. Part 4. With the Sullivan murder case solved, Paul Singlis and Pete Starr continued to work together as private detectives. They took on more cases, bringing justice to those who had been wronged and making a difference in their community. Their reputation grew, and they became known as two of the best private detectives in the business. They were respected by their peers and admired by their clients. As they looked back on their journey, they knew that they had made a difference in the world. They had brought closure to families who had lost loved ones, and they had helped to make their community a safer place. Answer. Paul and Pete continued on their path, solving cases and making a difference, one step at a time. They knew that their work was never done, but they were determined to keep fighting for justice and making the world a better place for all.